New online state standardized test officially rolling out today in Michigan schools, but not everyone's happy with the change. NBC 25 Stephanie Parkinson explains why some parents are actually pulling their kids out of the classroom. This new test follows the common core standards and that has some parents outraged. One mother I spoke with said her kids won't be taking this new test. For districts, this is concerning because it could mean backlash from the state. A mother fears this new form of testing creates a one size fits all approach to learning. It's dumbing down our children. You have to go all the way around the block to get the answer only to end up across the street from where you started. That's why Deborah Moore is pulling her two kids out. They won't take the new M-STEP test. It is just absolutely ridiculous. This year, the state plans not to hold districts accountable for the results. There is no academic advantage in any way whatsoever. The State Department of Education still says if participation drops below 95%, the state may take some action with districts, which is why leaders at Midland schools say they're taking this new test very seriously. We believe that um, this format of test is going to be valuable to us. A one size fits all classroom type of thing is not giving our teachers the permission they need and the creativity they need to have to help their students excel. The State Department of Education stresses students need to take this test. Clearly some government officials are trying to bully parents into submission. Deborah says Stop Common Core Michigan, a group advocating against this new testing, found proof in the state laws. Parents have a choice. Many educators, though, interpreting it differently. There is um, no legislation that technically allows a parent to opt out. Deborah's two kids go to school in the Sanford Meridian District. Our calls to the superintendent there were not returned today, but we're told students in that district will start the testing later this week. To avoid having her kids stay home, Deborah says the administration has set up another educational activity for her children to do while the other students are taking the test. In the newsroom, Stephanie Parkinson, NBC 25.